Today is Thursday. It's towards the end of the week, thank goodness. I missed you guys. I missed vlogging. I hope you guys enjoyed the last wedding episode. I know I didn't show like a lot of information like on the rings that we got and everything, but I do want to keep some things private. I didn't show too much of the exact rings that we got, but we did get our rings and it was perfect. So I'm kicking off another vlog today. I'm not sure if this is gonna be a day in the life or if it's gonna be like a full on week vlog. Maybe it might be, but today I'm actually going to a brand party by myself. I know it's kind of, it's really out of my comfort zone because I wish I had like that friend that I can go with, but I need to start networking and I need to start like meeting other people who are doing the same thing as me. So I'm gonna go by myself. I'm gonna see how the vibe is. And if it's not vibing, I'm just gonna leave obviously. But I'm gonna kick off today's vlog with a little unboxing. I got this really, really cool techie gift from Doogie or I'm not sure if it's Doogie or Doogie. I'm not really 100%, but I'm gonna say Doogie. I'm super excited to be trying out their new tablets. So this is the 256 gigabyte tablet. This is the T10 Pro. And here are just some of the details from the back. So this is the tablet guys. This size is kind of comparable to the iPad mini. This is much smaller and a lot more compact. And I love that this comes already done with a case. It actually also comes with a screen protector already, which is super, super nice. It seems like they sent me the color lavender, which is absolutely stunning. I'm gonna take off the case just so you guys can kind of see the whole thing. This is the case. And then this is the tablet. From the back, it definitely looks looks like it is an iPad. Before I do turn it on, it does actually have a slot here for a SIM card and as well an SD card. That is the screen. part with the circle actually moves the page normally like a apple pen okay the other side is an actual pen so do not write on your tablet which i almost did it's basically a mini ipad but it's half the price so i'm going to be linking this exact tablet in my description box as well as a discount code if you guys are looking for an affordable version of a ipad or just another tablet which is on the higher end this is a great alternative hello 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 i look so pasty right now but this is just my skin when i wash it um i'm getting ready now for the i have to put you guys like here I'm getting ready now for the party that I mentioned before. Getting all my makeup bits together. It is my time of the month and I feel so bloated. I feel like so crampy. Primed my face already with my clown makeup. Now I'm just gonna put on some moisturizer because my skin, I don't know when it turned into this dry mess. And recently I've added now a moisturizer to my makeup routine and it has like been such a game changer. Especially now that my skin is so, so dry. Like I don't know where that came from. Um, I'm using this moisturizer from Knipe and this one is Almond Something Daily Cream. So this is what I've been using on my skin which has worked really well. And then just to add some mattifying effect, I don't even know who this is from, this milk primer, just to kind of add to my T-zone so that when the makeup goes on, it doesn't look too crazy. 
I just do my T-zone. I'm gonna try a better angle for you guys so I don't wanna keep looking to the side. I posted this on my story and I was actually able to work with Giorgio Armani recently actually, so I now have two of these, but this is actually my uh, foundation and then I have the second one that they sent me. I love this foundation. I love this foundation. This is the Luminous Silk and I am in the 13.5. I think this is like, <sighs> this is everything. So I'm gonna put that on my face. Actually, no, I'm gonna do my, wait, what do I do first? No, I'm gonna do that first and then I'm gonna do my brows. I recently just did like a switch around of how I do my makeup. So foundation first and then my brows. And these days I'm using a brush to kind of apply everything. So why am I talking you guys through my makeup routine? Like this is a makeup routine video. Makeup is done. This is the look. I'm contemplating like putting my hair back like this because maybe this is like, I don't know, tying everything together. I'm not sure, but let me show you guys the perfume combination for the night. So I finally got my hands on the viral, I don't even know what this is called, but it is a viral perfume oil. Guys, I don't know the name. I would have to look it up and share later if you're interested. It's basically like this really fruity, not too fruity, because I've had fruity perfume oils before and it doesn't smell good, but this is kind of, mm, it's like bubbly. It's, I feel like there's a hint of like some cream underneath it. So it's not like this full on floral in your face, which I really like, but it actually smells so, so good. I'm gonna layer myself with it tonight because I love smelling myself. And then for the layering perfume, I'm in between right now. My Giorgio Armani perfume and then my Atelier Cologne um, Vanilla Incense. <sighs> I actually really like this one. Um, but the vanilla... I feel like this one could pair a little bit better with this perfume oil. So I think I'm gonna do the Atelier Cologne. Read this one. So basically, this is supposed to be a 90s inspired party. I feel like this is 90s inspired. I really hope so. I don't know, but it's comfortable and this is what I'm gonna wear. disheveled because I was playing with Bo for like 40 minutes on the phone with my sisters but I'm back now from the event whole thing it was absolutely beautiful I know I've been through or I've been to some events where it has not been like the best influencer experience but today was really really fun I got a few bellinis I actually got a tattoo <laughs> I got a tattoo that was like offered in the event. Um, they also had these teeth gems, which I also had before, but you guys know or you don't know, I do wear these like night aligner thingies. So I actually did not end up getting that, although I really love them. So I did that and it was actually for a brand called Kiko Milano, I believe. And if you've ever seen this brand, they have a huge range of makeup, basically makeup. And I think they're like branching into skincare. And so this event was like all about that. It was absolutely stunning. Getting there was a little low key, like sketchy because I have to go to this station, which I don't really enjoy going to. It's called Warsaw Strasse. I don't like going there as a woman by myself when it's dark doesn't matter if it's late or not, like if it's dark, I don't like it. But it was a beautiful event. I took an Uber home and now I wanna give you guys like a little haul of what I picked up. So I have this huge bag of stuff and basically how the event was set up, I can actually just go around and see the makeup. There was actually a makeup artist there and they kind of like talked me through some of the stuff and I also could just basically pick up anything that I like and test it out here. So that's exactly what I did and guys, I got so much stuff. First thing that I picked up is this crazy 90s 
puff face cleansing sponge so it's kind of like this if i'm rushing it's because it's 11 43 it is a thursday i have to work on friday and i still need to take bow out so that's why i'm rushing right now okay the next thing i picked up is this crazy 90s roller serum lip balm and if i haven't mentioned already the theme of this whole event party was 90s Bo is looking at me right now i feel like he really has to go out so i'm gonna try to do this fast um so this is the roller balm serum i also picked up this three-in-one face brush and i think this was really really cool because it's perfect for when you go traveling so this is the brush it has a natural head and then it has a beauty blender part here. And then this part is like a little small brush. So I thought that was like really, really handy and could save me a lot of space when I go traveling. Then I got this happy clean, happy cleansing face stick. Still not necessarily sure how this works, but it smells it smells great so it looks like this then i picked up this make me glitter face mask and i saw this and i was like this looks so cute and then you open it you can kind of see that this is glitter how cute so this is the comb and define eyebrow mascara this is in the color black i did just get my brows laminated so i thought this could be really cool and then there we have the brow bit. Then I got this matte liquid lip color. And this one's in number three. The makeup artist actually helped me pick this one out. So I loved how it looked. I got another gloss. This is a vol vol oh, voluminizer. Oh my God. And it's also like this really beautiful pink. And I smelt this one when I was there. And oh my God, it smells just like candy. We are back again at my makeup table. I actually did get a new tripod because I was like, this is not going to work with the situation I had yesterday. So I am actually getting ready again. It's Friday, by the way. I'm getting ready now to meet up with a subscriber or a follower from Instagram. I'm not 100% sure where they found me from originally but i'm really excited i'm also really proud of myself because i am venturing out of my weird little i am not talking to people bubble broken i'm venturing out of my secluded shell that i was in before when i was you know doing my masters and just trying to like keep up with work and now putting that into meeting new people and making new connections basically so I'm really excited. We're gonna be going to this place called The Alchemist. And I've been there a few times with a, another friend as well with Sven, and I really like the place. So we're gonna go back. We're gonna see what the vibe is and just enjoy yourselves. So I am getting ready again. I'm gonna run through my whole makeup and then give you guys like a OOTD. The weather in Berlin is trash. I think I've mentioned this before. I love Berlin, but the weather here is it's terrible if you come from a sunny place if you're coming from even new york like let's just even say new york you're coming from new york we do get rain we get snow da, da, da. if you come to berlin the weather is completely different it's cloudy it's gray the first year i was here it fooled me because like i came in summer and it was like one of the best summers i've ever had anywhere and it was amazing and then after that when once that that first winter hit it's just been downhill and this summer as well has been absolute trash so beware people berlin weather it's it's like it's like british weather Bo is like right behind my chair i do not want to roll him over he literally if i could show you guys him he literally loves to just sit behind my my chair sit underneath my work chair like it's a rolling chair yeah i feel like i look really top heavy right now but that is just the reality of it so let me show you guys the blazer that i'm going to be wearing with this outfit okay so i picked up this blazer from naked i got it in a eu 38 it's basically just an oversized twill blazer black blazer and i always wanted one i actually ripped this off and if you guys are like just wondering in general why i even am like getting dressed up i like to get dressed up because i have 
I keep saying that I have nowhere to go, but I actually am going places these days. But the, the reality of it is I have a lot of clothes. Like I have clothes that I just don't wear and the majority of them are not appropriate for work <laughs> like today's outfit and anytime like any opportunity i get to like go out to dinner or like just go have fun with some friends or sven or whatever i like to get dressed up because i have this clothes like the clothes are just sitting in my closet taking up space breathing air and not paying any rent so anyways so this is the blazer on I have on my skims and it's tightening this tummy area but then the pants have now become like super high-waisted because I have no tummy anymore. I am contemplating if um, I'm gonna wear like these sock heel boots if that's giving a little bit too much. It's giving like date night and I'm just meeting somebody. Um, but then it's like, girl, just do whatever you want. So yeah, I'm either thinking about my sock boots or I'm gonna wear sneakers or I might wear boots. I don't know this is gonna be the bag of the night this is my teddy blake i don't know what name this bag is um but they sent this to me a while ago and it has been i love this bag it's a staple i wear it whenever i can it also has bag strap here which i love and it's in it's in this like gray color which is also quite unique it's gold detailing so i'm gonna be wearing this mm -hmm. 